welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Jandira and I do videos on luxury unboxing I do vlogs as well as building a curated more elevated closet I'll be doing a lot of unboxings this year is gonna be awesome I'm so excited so if you haven't subscribed go ahead and do so and hit the notification bell so you're notified of when I upload new videos today <laughs> We're doing the unboxing and I'm so excited. My first ever, 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 ever Chanel handbag. Guys, this is a moment. I've already named her, by the way. She will be Chanel because she's the first. <laughs> she's stunning, she's beautiful, and I can't wait to unbox her. Yeah, I'm going to be doing the unboxing. We're going to talk about the specs. I'm also going to talk about my experience at Chanel buying the bag and hints on how you can also score this same bag as well as just talking about <laughs> Chanel price increase and what are good and not so great investment pieces. Stay tuned until the end for all that information if you're interested and let's just get right into it, right? Let's, let's just open her up. <laughs> We're going to do it the proper way, the way she deserves to be, you know, introduced into my closet, basically. Oh, my camellia fell! Mm. Here's a box that she came in, and we have the receipt up here. I'm gonna set this to the side. This is how she comes in a nice, beautiful box with a bow. Let's go ahead and undo this ribbon. And ta-da! This is the bag. Isn't she lovely? She's so pretty. And let me go ahead and take out the protective lining so you guys can see her in her full glory. So the bag will come with these protective belts and that's just when she's not carrying it. It's just a little level of protection just over the bag. Okay. So that's all that is. Here you go, guys. Isn't she lovely? She's just so beautiful. She has the caviar leather. It's matte, finished, it's beige. She has the gold hardware and the gold double chain. She also has a double flap very spacious medium size bag the lipstick pockets in the back pockets that front pocket right here i think this is just a perfect size especially because i do have my baby if i need to carry things for him then i have the back pocket where you could put tip money or keys or anything like that i am going to get the lining for her just so i can protect the beautiful interior of the bag I don't think I'm ever going to resell her, but if I do, at least it will be nice and protected. Ah, isn't she beautiful? So this is Chanelli. Say hello. <laughs> So inside the box, it comes with a little booklet that talks a little bit about the bag. It gives the specs on the bag. It also has my little certification of purchase, which is pretty awesome and sweet. Um, it's a very great memory, something that I'm definitely going to keep. Because I have people that I am ODD, I come on, I'm on Instagram. Because if you think about it, the law, we don't have that way to it, so it will kind of create a balance there because that's the only way. 
also comes with a little envelope that um, talks about, you know, the specifics on like how to care for the bag. And I honestly don't know what this is. So let me look. Oh, I guess it's just another little dust bag to protect the bag. I'm not gonna lie, when I first bought her, I had a little like Sex in the City moment where Carrie was in. Oh, excuse me, sir. I know this sounds ridiculous, but can you tell me which way is West Broadway? Give me a bag. What? It, it... And your Manola Blahniks. What? No! Give me a f Blonics. These guys weren't just after money anymore. They were after fashion. <laughs> guys! She's so expensive. But um, I'm not going to say the price. You can look on the website if you're curious. It is quite an expensive bag. And like I said, the price is only going to go up. So it, it's definitely something that if you want to invest in a Chanel Classic flap, do so as soon as possible like as soon as you can that's my tip so as far as my experience um buying this bag i saw on the, my birthday vlog my husband basically wanted to gift me a chanel bag because i've always wanted one since i was just a very tiny little girl <laughs> and finally you know we were able to afford it and he wanted to surprise me for my birthday so we went to the chanel store um, I will say that I already had a relationship with our sales associate. Um, I had been to the store a couple of times before then. I bought a, couple, a pair of shoes. I, I showed it in a previous vlog. I didn't show going into the store, but I showed the shoes I bought. And so we kind of had a relationship with her. Because of the everything going on with the holidays and COVID, they weren't they were only taking people by appointment and so we basically he didn't know if we were going to be able to go into the store but he did say you know sarah's a social associate which is her name sarah she's at the highlands in dallas he was more than willing to see us and she didn't have anybody else scheduled at that at that moment so we were able to get into the store and you know look around and find my dream bag <laughs> i didn't know that they were going to have the flat bag because the last time i i did go to buy the shoes they didn't so it was a total like one of those perfect moments meant to be kind of things you know and in i was looking at all these bags and i kind of told her you know i i really wanted like a classic bag preferably in beige or black and you know we looked around we couldn't really find any she showed me some other things and then she said well just hold on because I know we had a shipment come in let me go in the back and see you know what came in and so she goes to the back to look and then she comes out with this gorgeous beauty Chanel -y. she's like basically she's the only one that got here today um, I wanted initially I wanted a smaller size I wanted the small but once i saw it and once i actually tried it on and i just absolutely fell in love with it i didn't even care that it was a medium i just i just really wanted her and <laughs> so basically we got her <laughs> these bags are pretty hard to come by um she said that you know they sell it very fast and they're not making as many of them anymore because i feel like they kind of want to keep it, um, you know, something that's desirable and something that's hard to get, I guess. I don't know. Also, maybe because of COVID. But um, so they don't come around often. So make sure that, you know, you have a relationship with your sales associate. Um, if you have never purchased anything from Chanel, just go into the store and maybe buy, you know, like, I don't know, earrings or something, a pair of shoes. They're a lot more affordable, but still, you know, you're paying a nice pretty penny but that way you're establishing a relationship with a sales associate and when one does come you can have you know just let them know that you're you're in the hunt for one you might be you know the lucky owner of a flat bag so i'm so so happy with this bag tell me what you guys think if you guys thought this was a great first purchase i will be doing a lot more of these videos from unboxing bags shoes whatever luxury item 
I, you know, can get my hands on. Um, I have a list, a wish list. I'm thinking of doing a wish list video. Let me know if you guys would be interested in that or not. I really want to kind of talk you through my whole thought process with building my closet and the pieces that I am planning on purchasing in 2021. So let me know if that's something that you guys are interested in. So if you like this video, go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Turn on the post notification bell and I will see you guys on my next video. Love you. Bye-bye. <laughs>